Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to day number seven of our Japan vlogs. There's JT fucking dingling around. Yeah. Um, today we are not doing too much. Um, we're gonna wander around Shibuya, we're gonna do some shopping, we're gonna go to Yoyogi Park uh, during the day and at night because at night there's some cool lights and during the day we're gonna go and take some photos. And what else are we doing? Is it? Uh, yeah. All right, yeah, so um, pretty mellow day. Probably not gonna be vlogging too much, but Take you guys with me. All right, guys. So starting out the day, this sushi place again. You can never go wrong with sushi in Japan. All right, guys. So we got our sushi, and we are just waiting for the train right now. We are heading over to Yoyogi Park to the Meiji Shrine. It's super dope. So I'm gonna get some footage of that for you guys. All right, guys. So made it to the entrance to the Meiji Shrine. It's starting to rain a little bit. So, I got the little umbrella from 7-Eleven. It's like $5 US, which is pretty awesome actually. So, yeah, this place looks pretty cool already. Yeah, so this shrine's pretty awesome because on the way there, you walk through this like really deep forest. It's just really, really beautiful looking. You hear birds fighting in the background. There's not that many people out here today, which is nice. Probably because it's really shitty out and rainy. Out of focus. So this is where you're supposed to cleanse your your hands before you go into the shrine. Hey, you come back, I wanna give you a chance. Love me like you used to, so we can learn again. The skin is getting brown, maybe drink tonight away, maybe we will not regret it, you will not regret it, me. Laying down under the sun, burning love, cause we are young. No one tells us what's done wrong. It's just me and you
going into the Meiji Gardens. Um, seemed to be pretty cool from what we saw. It was 500 yen to get in, about five bucks American. So figured we'd just give it a shot. We're already here. The shrine was really cool, so why not? Ooh, look at this. Okay, this place is beautiful. Ooh. Ooh. Oh wow, I was right. I was not expecting this. No. This is so incredibly beautiful. The reflections off the water look amazing. Just the colors at this time of year are just great. I don't see anything like this. California, that's for sure. Got some koi buds right here. I love that there's koi fish in like every single pond and they're always just chilling. Alright guys, so this right here is all the sake barrels that uh, the sake companies donated to the shrine, which is pretty awesome. They're all like old school and everything. It's pretty cool. <laughs> and I believe these are also sake barrels over here. I'm actually not sure. They almost look like whiskey barrels. Not sure. Oh, this is this more sake? Oh, it's wine. Okay. These are all wine barrels. Okay, that's pretty cool. Alright guys, so we're at Takeshita Street in Harajuku. This is right outside of the area where the shrine was. It's leading us to another shrine. But this is like a crazy busy street. Lots of little stalls, like souvenirs and everything. We got on there. We got all types of stuff here. Little kimonos, hats, Pokemon socks. Chicken shit. That's kind of sick, actually. Look at this, JT. It's kind of sick. That's sick. Japanese Star Wars. So this is the street where they have the world famous crepes. I'm actually not gonna get any because we're both really not in the mood, but if you were looking for it, this is the street to get it at. All right, so we made it to another little small shrine. Pretty cool, I know it's kind of hard to see camera does not have the best low light, but very mellow shrine. The offering box, fortunes. Typical, pretty cool though. All right guys, so sorry for the bad lighting, but we're actually headed to a spot that's like kind of by where we just were at that uh, really sick temple. 
It's got a really cool like blue lights on all the trees in this park. So we're gonna go wander through there. We're just walking up on it. Now we can kind of see it, see if I can show you. So there it is over there. You can kind of see it, but I'll show you an up close and in personal view of everything once we get there. Oh yeah, this looks awesome. Like Looks like there's a bathroom right up here. Oh. Definitely puts you in the Christmas spirit. Kind of. It looks like shit on my camera. Damn it. I don't know if it's picking it up properly on the camera, but this is insane. All right, so if you guys come to Japan, this is one of the things you gotta be aware of. You get these like in-floor toilets. Pretty crazy. Because most bathrooms have normal toilets too, so. place is pretty sick. Highly recommend checking out one of these places. Um, this is at Yoyogi Park, right near Shibuya in Harajuku. But it's pretty awesome. It's kind of hard to tell on camera, but it's really, really bright blue lights on all these trees, all the way down to here. You get this building lit up, the blue lights as well. They sell beer and food and stuff there. It's pretty cool, it goes pretty far down. Obviously, there's a lot of people here. It goes pretty far down there. It's pretty cool, though. They do it at, uh, looks like Sapporo, Sendai, Nagoya, Osaka, Hiroshima, and uh, Fukuoka, if I said that correctly, and here in Yoyogi Park, Shibuya. So, pretty awesome. I would check this out if you're in town during uh, probably end of November, I think they always do it. I know it just started. I'm not exactly sure when, but we're here in the end of November, and that's what's going on. So this here, just like this crazy reflection. It's definitely not water. Pretty insane. Alright guys, so it's this guy's birthday as of right now. Blake, happy birthday. Thank you guys. Come pie. Come pie, or cheers as they say in English. Um, 24 years young, and you know, just yeah, this enjoying it. This this trip was uh, kind of planned around my birthday. I wanted to do some, something cool, something different. I mean, normally me and my buddies would just go, go out to bars or something, and get drunk in, in the States, and it's like, yeah, why not just go to Japan? Yeah. So we did it, yeah. and we're here, and it's coming towards the end of the trip, and hopefully you guys have been enjoying the videos that we're putting together. Um, I don't know how many people are even going to view these. It's more for more for us than anything, but yeah. yeah. So. Oh, uh, what, what are we doing tomorrow morning? Um, tomorrow, for my actual birthday, because technically I mean it's 12.02, technically on my birthday, but tomorrow we're going to Nanoblock store, the flagship store, and basically... We're nerding out. Huh? Huh? Basically, you nerd out, go to Nano Block store, get some lip food. It's gonna be a good day. So uh, yeah, we'll take for, you guys with us. Looking for some uh, some souvenirs, some like other stuff. Um, actually, where did I put that that little thing I got? And here it is. I actually found this earlier, and this is what kind of inspired it. I mean, you guys saw, we got all the Pokemon shit and everything, like, yeah, Pokemon's great, I love Pokemon, but if you can find something like this, it's like, it's pretty awesome, like, it's a little shrine. Yeah, like, very cool. 
Cool little, yeah. little souvenir. Let's see, I got like, I got the nano block pad because building these things is incredibly difficult. And got a samurai. Yep. All right, we'll take you guys with us tomorrow. All right, guys, so on that note, I'm closing out today's vlog. I know there was not too much going on, but I mean, we're in Japan. We're just having fun. We're not really focused on filming everything, but I tried to film as much as I can. I mean, if you're on vacation, go enjoy what you're doing. Don't focus on filming it for others to see. I mean, it's more for memories for us, but I'm just saying, you know. But yeah, that's gonna be it for today. We're gonna take you guys with us tomorrow. Same old thing, you already know. Let's do what we're gonna do. Today's my birthday, 24 years young. Peace guys and have a good one.